Uh, this is what we call an ad hominem argument. This is nothing to do with what the Bible says about the gift of prophecy. It's only saying, well, you know, there are bad stuff that's happening out there, so we shouldn't believe uh, anything that's associated with that bad stuff. Uh, I just remind you that there are tons of cessationist leaders we, throughout history who have fallen into horrible sexual sins. Does that mean that we shouldn't believe Reformed theology or that we shouldn't believe uh, in typical cessationist doctrines uh, because there are some bad apples in the bunch? No, uh, because that's an argument against someone's character, not against what the Bible actually says. This argument that's playing with the eight ball, well, they get everything wrong, has nothing to do with what the Bible says about the gift of prophecy. Uh, let me toss it over to our guest, Dr. Brown. What would you have to say about a clip that, you know, charismatics, they get it mostly wrong more than they get it right. Therefore, we shouldn't believe in the gift of prophecy. Yeah, I do want to reinforce what you say. The question is what the Bible says. I don't base my theology on experience. And that's an experientially based statement. I, I base my theology on what the word says.